APC planning to use Loretta Onoche to rig 2023 elections, Wiki. Governor Yeso Wiki says President Muhammad Buhari's nomination as INEC National Commissioner is part of APC's grand plans to rig the 2023 elections. The Rivers governor who spoke at an event to commemorate his six years in office held in Portacot on Monday said Mr. Buhari and his APC cohort's refusal to withdraw Ms. Onoche's nomination was ominous. Okay. Despite the flaws of protest against her nomination and the general lack of trust in her capacity to remain impartial, it seems the APC-led Senate is determined to confirm her appointment as part of their grand design to rig the 2023 general elections well ahead of time, Mr. Wiki claimed. He also warns that appointing Ms. Onoche, a former APC member, would worsen INEC's credibility crisis. She was nominated as INEC commissioner last October. As a governor and a concerned Nigerian who wants this country so much and wants our democracy to survive, I wish to appeal to Mr. President for the sake of legacy to withdraw Ms. Onoche's nomination to avoid creating more credibility crisis for INEC and restore confidence in our electoral system. Apparently before the Senate Committee uh, on INEC on Thursday, Ms. Onoche denied being an APC member. Since Buhari was elected as president for the second term, I have removed myself from anything about politics. Since 2019, I don't have anything to do with politics. I am not, as I am sitting here, I am not a member of any political party in this country. And that is what she told the committee. On Sunday, ex INEC chairman Atahiru Jaga advised Mr. Buhari to find another woman to replace Loretta Onoche because she lacks credibility. For some of the documents, I have been privileged to see both her British citizenship on, and also her belonging to a political party until 2019. If we, if we believe she had disengaged from the party since 2019, you would try to avoid appointing such people into electoral commission because it can create controversy. Mr. Jagger said. He added, to be honest, the president can just withdraw her nomination. After all, there are so many other women with credibility, capacity and competence in Delta State and Cross River State. All right. Um, I'm not even like, wait, is WK part of APC or PDP? Because <laughs> I'm not really sure. Like, obviously, um, a lot of things are going on but then it's like he can't say the truth absolutely but then can his message also be compromised oh we case for the pdp uh Dicker, this makes things even clearer now um so it's part of the pdp because i'm like if you're part of the apc would you really complain about this really like being very very honest um so yeah that's really what it is i mean what do you guys think? Because at this point, who can we really trust? Why should we trust? Why is the governor or I mean, why is the president appointing people like this? I mean, I guess there's some things, some positions you get voted into and some, and some you get appointed as. But I don't know why he, you know, appoints somebody who, I mean, again, INEC itself is not even credible. So whoever is representing them anyway, I mean, we don't even take them seriously like that. So again, I mean, from a long time, it's not like as if, We've seen INEC as a credible source and then we're comparing back and saying that, okay, you know what? There's a difference right now from where it was to where it is now. Absolutely not. So again, maybe INEC is the issue and maybe the process in which votes are being counted is the actual issue. But then, of course, that makes sense because, you know, even if your processes are right, the people controlling those processes can also, you know, rig, basically. Um... So yeah, that that's just what it is. Someone here says, Wiki, why are you afraid? Um, or why you are afraid of APC planning to rig elections? Take note you're a master when it comes to rigging of elections. According to the saying, a man who did not bite did not want himself to bite. So when people are talking about rigging elections, Mr. Wiki should shut his mouth. All right. APC is useless. God is stronger than man. <laughs> 
<laughs> all than them okay uh mr wiki you are a mad man okay um i mean what I, I don't know how i really don't know how i don't know how this change is gonna happen because with the elections they've already they've already planned themselves they've already planned what they're gonna do so i'm not really sure of course wiki is of the other party because i'm sure if he was part of apc i don't think we would hear anything like this saying oh he's planning to rig elections and all that um again who is the face who are they planning to represent them for the elections because the, it definitely cannot be buhari but it can be the same party so still um i don't know how but it's tough uh it's really tough uh someone here says the issue of anarchist nigeria is not seen as a political science anymore but tribal and regional power exactly so again it's like why are we pretend like as if it was a credible credible thing before uh, whereby some people take it as a right to appoint someone that would dance to their music when whenever the drum is sound um god can take life of any oh wow. oh wow. this person went extreme god can take the life of anybody before the 2023 election so leave it for god so what are you trying <laughs> okay um someone says who PDP was using before PDP was master rigor of all time. Again, PDP has been in government for what? How many years? Before APC even got the the, the, the privilege. <laughs> because of how long, you know, they've been in power. I guess that's just what it is. Um, Loretta is like Lai Mohammed. You cannot trust them. Uh, watch Silence to Shomole. We'll see them soon. Nigeria should stop allowing people with foreign passports in our government. How does that make any sense? How, how what please that don't make sense at all so your loyalty to the country because the ones that, that that do not have or the ones that claim they do not have a different citizenship are they doing the best job please um that has nothing to do with anything the fact is again i cannot be trusted this one cannot be trusted the current government cannot be trusted so the fact is who do we trust as an independent body to make sure that whoever is president is president again at this point, it seems like as if there's really no hope to, in terms of trying to make, you know, things credible. Um, so, yeah, that's just what it is. Um, so, yeah. Uh, somebody here says, nothing but the truth. Oh, okay. Um, what, 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 the issue of Anak in Nigeria is seen, is no seen as political science anymore. I would dance their music and politics, not considering the voice of Nigerians because everyone is being controlled by them. Honestly, I don't think you can change this. Put what you think about this in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe.